A dispute has broken out about the potential new name of the former Yugoslav Republic of Macedonia. The Greek Prime Minister Alexis Tsipras and the Macedonian Prime Minister Zoran Zaev finally reached an agreement to name the Phyron the Republic of Northern Macedonia. But the Macedonian president, Jorge Ivanov, says he will veto the deal. So why is there such an uproar? Well, the new name will be used internationally and domestically, and the people will be Macedonians, and the language will be Macedonian, but originally Slavic. However, several critics say the deal's problematic. The accord must be approved by Macedonians in a referendum, and by parliaments of both countries, where nationalists and opposition parties have vowed to resist it. Also, Greece's new democracy leader says that Tsipras lacks the authority to sign it. After the deal has been signed and ratified, a Greek letter will be sent to the EU and NATO. So, at an EU summit, Phyrom can be invited to start EU membership talks. Then NATO will invite them to the summit in July. The referendum is due between September and December this year. The NATO ratification could take 24 months. There may be smiles and handshakes by some, but whether the beginning of this process will actually start will be decided in the coming days.